get a picture of it, we've got Farah Nair right by the pitch to give us a feel of what's it like at the moment. Not just includes JDT1, it also features a lot of the players from JDT2 who are part of... PNJ, uh, all the staff here, all the players that have come in as well. The infrastructure, the, uh, the, the thinking behind it, you know, it's not just about taking care of himself uh, in, in the centre uh, center of the park. I think you've got uh, JDT as an exciting player in this team offensively, but JDT as well, we haven't had the time to speak about him. Even he, in, in an interview with Astro yesterday as well, just briefly mentioned just how um, exciting it is. 20 is a FIFA accredited referee as well. Um, he probably got one of the best in the country to officiate this match. Jordi Ahmad, Berks and Da Silva, Corbin Ong. Um, from JDT's point of view, it's, it's, it's going to be very difficult. There you go, it's kickoff for the international club, a friendly fixture between uh, Johor Dal Takzeb and Borussia Dortmund, and JDT will be attacking from the left to the right of your screens in that classic blue kit. Got early indications here, Don goes back to Justin Jinma, tries to combine with Jaden Braff. Pressure from Jordi Ahmad, referee blows for a free kick. It's uh, looking a bit shaky for JDT in the early minutes here. Expected from uh, Borussia Dortmund, despite all those changes to the lineup, in spite of the fact that they've got younger players, in this squad, you still expect to see that European level of play, that high intensity, that high tempo. To help out the team defensively is Daniel Marlin, Jaden Braff into the box. There's a vital uh, tackle from Jordi Ahmad, yet another corner kick. And having to come across quickly, his defence was in trouble. Again, this is yellow shirts all over here. Bit of a combination inside the box there, but it goes out for a corner kick. And they play out from the pressure there. Rufus making himself available there. Jaden Braff inside the box. Goes out for yet another corner kick. Jordi Ahmad Sharusa of Sharul Sa'ad's quality, who's widely respected in this region, is being uh, completely bullied over there. Jaden Sancho. Um, it's not been easy for him at the club. No, it hasn't been easy for him at all. I might in this match. And, and the fans here, yeah, they know. They know who the uh, star players are. You know, there was a real sense of excitement. You could hear it get uh, a lot louder when running the Dortmund defence. Right now, there was a uh, chance trying to play Daniel Marlin through. Yeah. He threw the uh, system at Wolves. The ball to take down, but he did well to do that. And... Uh, Saw that Schultz was just rough. Jordi Savage collects the ball, races into the box. He was I think waiting for the pass in that in the box. Well, the cutback was uh, was it's crowded out by two Dortmund players. It's Semich who takes it off him, looking for that cutback. Mix of uh, Daniel Marlin, Emery Chan could be uh, subbed off at halftime for precautionary measures. Dortmund regain possession. Here's uh, Rukov trying to find a bit of space inside towards uh, Sharusan. Jordi Ahmad finds uh, Feroz. Semich looking forward. Neat sequence of passes. Jordi Ahmad finds uh, Safik Rahim. Players coming from Europe. But going back to that goal again, I mean, there was barely any time if you're Farizal, if you're Feroz, this Be sure, be certain of exactly what the opposition are, are, are going to be doing. And that element of surprise can, can really affect you. Some of them by themselves, because it's a club that always gives opportunities for the young players. And that's right. And uh, we're seeing those opportunities, you know, here being given such a pace. Joseph uh, caught uh, Collins. Play on Hong Wan. Finds uh, Jordi Ahmad. Here's a uh, first bit of action for Sidibe. Last two, three minutes. Not exactly indicate that it's been that friendly. But some of these JDT players can definitely be uh, satisfied with the level of performances uh, that they've put on today. Corbin Ong has been relatively solid at left back. 
Jordi Amat. Shoffing again. It's a bit of a run from Shami Safari. Can he get there in time? No. For that, here's uh, Coleman up against uh, Jordi Amat. Does really well to stand up against him. Amat now plays it towards. Plays it towards uh, Jordi Amat. Matinda for Jodo Bangsip. Again, another substitution this time around. It's uh, skipper Ideal Safwan. Someone we don't get to see regularly in the starting 11 anymore these days. But nonetheless, it's such a